Hey everybody, welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to go over basic commands in CSGO, right? So, this is going to be the first one, clear. You just type clear in, it clears your entire console, that's about it, okay? When I go into a server, right, an offline server, I just type map D, and then let's say Mirage, D underscore Mirage. I'm loading into Mirage right now, and then I have my warm-up config bound to K, so I join a team, press K, and here we are. I can buy anywhere, I have pretty much unlimited money, right, I can fly around, it has the nade lines, right? So that's how I do that. Then, I want out of this, I'll clear it so you guys can see, I type disconnect, and I'm out of it, alright? Pretty easy stuff. Other things that you'll see me type, alright, that I think is pretty important, um, volume, right? So you can change your volume into like decimal increments. I have my numpad, um, the 1, 2, and 3 on the numpad correlate to 0 0.25, 0 0.5, and 0.75 on the, well, for like volume, but sometimes 0.75 is not loud enough. If I'm in a Discord call with really loud people, I might turn it up to 0.9, um, or if I'm just DMing and I'm listening to like a podcast or something, I might turn it down to like 01. So those are some other things that you can do with commands and console. Um, if you're in a server, and let me just join a random server right here, right? So I'm just in a server, and let's say something freezes, or it's obviously like the game didn't freeze, but my connection to the server is a little janky, right? I can type retry, and it's going to reconnect me to the server again. Um, I'm sure many of you have experienced the bug where you're, uh, you're in a server, and the your frames start to drop all of a sudden you have like 20 frames everything seems normal but you have like 20 frames all right if you type record one and then stop real quick all right that should fix your issue don't ask me why but it should all right these are just common commands that you should know now for making binds and things let's get out of the server for making binds most of the time I will, I'm not going to go into like the settings menu and find the game options and all that. I will just go and find the bind, well type the binds in manually. So if I want to, let's say, have a keyboard bind that will spam something in chat. For example, get good. I would say bind, uh, and you want to use like quotations and stuff. Let's do bind the minus key, alright. Say get good, alright. And now if we go in game using my thing I just showed you, right? So now we should be able to, hypothetically, press minus and it will say get good. You can change it to team and all that, um, or something, let's see. See, look, works perfectly. So let me unbind that, and now it doesn't come up, all right? So there's other things, like if you want to bind, um, your numpad there's steam guides i'll link a steam guide in the uh description of this video because you can't just do if you want to do like numpad three you can't just do three it's like um num page down or something like that right um but i'll link a uh steam guide in the description of this so you guys can see that I'm just trying to rack my brain for like other binds um lots of people have asked me how i speed things up right that's just host time scale so it would be probably MP host time host time. All right, new bind or new 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 command. If you can't find something but you know what it's called, you type find host time scale. There it is, host underscore time scale one, and then you can up that to like 500, and it makes things go really fast. You put it down to one, and it's normal speed. You put it at. You can even do host time scale 0.5 and now I'm moving super slow right so there's a lot of cool things that you can do with it um, racking my brain for other things most I, I cannot recall the last time I actually found the quit option um, to leave the game I always just type quit in console if you don't know how to open your console and you've made it this far in the video it's tilde you have to enable game developer options in your settings let's see if I can find that real quick Ooh, game, uh, no, develop, yeah, enable developer console, all right, you have to have that turned on, you, the tilde key, the thing under your escape, the little squiggly line, right, that's how you open up console, um, you can resize console if you want, 
So sometimes, you know, you want it bigger, whatever. Um, I think that's about it, boys. I don't think there's anything else. I will link my uh, warm-up config in the uh, description of this video. Liam, while editing here, I probably should have noted how to actually bind your warm-up config to a key. It's just your normal bind, quote, key, quote, quote, warmup.cfg, end quote, or whatever your warmup.cfg is titled, that's what you want it. Uh, same thing can be used for an auto-execute. But I think for like just general things that I will use all the time, those are pretty much it. Uh, well, general commands that I use, that's pretty much it. As you can see, quit out of the game, video is pretty much done. Uh, thanks for watching, hope you have a good day, and I will see you next time.